I think it's safe to say that anyone who's a fan of dinosaurs has at least heard of Spinosaurus. It was depicted in Jurassic Park 3 where it actually defeated Tyrannosaurus Rex. It's commonly accepted that it was actually a larger animal than Tyrannosaurus Rex, even if it wasn't as robustly built. However, latest evidence suggests that it didn't quite look like how we expect. Predatory dinosaurs tend to be exclusively theropods. However, recent research has suggested that Spinosaurus actually walked on all fours, most of the time at least, whereas its front body weight was simply too heavy to constantly balance on two legs. It was also thought that Spinosaurus spent most of its time in water, similar to a hippopotamus or crocodile. Everything for this is seen by how streamlined it is. The small holes in its nose would allow it to sense disturbances in the water and hunt fish, and it also had a large crocodilian hooked snout which would allow it to catch slippery prey. Now a lot of people don't like the new shape of Spinosaurus, they preferred it as this two-legged monster that would do battle with Tyrannosaurus rex and the other predators of the time like Carcharodontosaurus. However this does raise an interesting question. If Spinosaurus hadn't gone extinct, what would it have potentially evolved into? We see a similar thing with Amblocetus and early whales starting to adapt more to life underwater. Could we have had aquatic dinosaurs? Let me know in the comments below what, what are your thoughts on the new Spinosaurus. Me personally, I don't mind it, but a lot of people are getting quite offended by it. Like the video if you did, share it with a friend if you think they'll like it, and of course if you haven't already, subscribe for more creepy content.